In for Jay today. Hey, happy first day of fall, everybody. Uh, hard to believe. Uh, it doesn't feel like it out there this afternoon, those temperatures in the 80s, but uh, it does in the mornings, though. We get those uh, cool overnight temperatures, and it's been a very pleasant week weather wise. If I would check a few webcams out here and see if there's any fall color showing up. Uh, first, uh, go down to Mammoth Cave and I mean, just a hint if you look really, really close there. Then we'll go up to Brown County, Indiana, uh, outside of Nashville. And uh, no tree color, but uh, man, that grass is brown. <laughs> you know, I, you wonder, though, this dry weather, if it's going to mess the uh, fall color up because uh, it, I don't know if it's going to dull it down any. All right, I've got a few more to show you here. S Smoky Mountains. And again, you, you see a little bit of color here and there. I don't know if that's, you know, from weather, the, the dry weather or if that's just the higher elevations that's starting up there because here's another shot of the Smokies, which is just breathtaking, but no fall color there. New England, probably a couple of weeks away. Uh, don't see a whole lot of color in this shot in New Hampshire and uh, even up in Michigan uh, where they're two to three weeks away from peak color. Again, uh, Still a lot of green out there. And our peak color here is usually right around October 25th. So it's 32 days away if you're making your plans there. Some, of some years it's as early as uh, about the 22nd, 23rd, and other years uh, maybe the 28th, 29th. So right in that time frame there. As I said, it feels like summer though. We're at 85 right now. Humidity is down though, only 33% east breeze at 9. 85 or high today, 58 this morning. Nowhere near the record high for today. That was 97 uh, set five years ago. At least the ragweed has dropped off just a bit now in the moderate category. Widespread 80s with a few 70s out there. Cleveland only at 72 right now. And as we showed you earlier, uh, there's the rain and clouds out in the plains and upper Midwest. Watching this system uh, over the southeast coast here. This is the one that could be building up. And that's the question. How further west will this go? Because usually they don't go across the mountains much, but watch, the, watch this forecast here. There's tomorrow morning. By late in the day tomorrow, the rain is uh, moving into the North Carolina Tennessee border with some clouds in the southeast Kentucky. Great day here tomorrow. Go tomorrow night, clouds spreading in by Friday morning. And look at this rain over southeast Kentucky. And then during the day Friday, the first batch of rain kind of dries out, but there's another batch coming in that could be here Friday night. Uh, we'll have to see how this develops over the next couple of days. But uh, originally, this was expected to stay to the east of our area. Now it's uh, kind of building in further west, and the RPM model does show by 5 o'clock Friday uh, a few hundred southeast of us. If we get rain out of this, it would be more likely uh, Friday night. 80s tomorrow, and then as the clouds and rain move in, we'll be in the 70s with 60s in East Kentucky on Friday. So there's your changes coming our way. Nothing for tonight, though. Clear in 60 in the city, 50s in the suburbs. 85, lots of sun, pretty much a repeat of today's weather. And then on Friday, 30% chance, and that's more like Friday evening. Uh, and then Saturday, I've got cloudy skies, 30% chance of rain. Temperatures in the 70s with those clouds. Sunday, we're back into the 80s, and there's a total eclipse of the moon Sunday evening. And then uh, quiet weather uh, into next week. And on, you know, the Saturday forecast is real tricky because if the system does come in and if the rain chances go up, if we get rain Saturday, it may actually stay in the 60s on Saturday. So uh, it, it, I mean, it's, that's what's hard on forecasting this because, you know, usually our weather comes from the west, you know, and not from, you know, Georgia or the Atlantic, you know, out in the Atlantic there. But that's what's going to be happening in the next 48 well, hours. It feel certainly like fall then if that happens. Well, you know. I think some people are ready for that. I don't, yeah. I don't know. But I don't. I, I love know, the evenings. Yeah. Oh, it's been wonderful. <laughs>